Today's video is a review of the DB method labeled as the best squat machine on their site. So what exactly is the DB method machine? The DB method was started by Erica Raymond. She spent four years creating this machine, helping thousands of people experience the joy, confidence, and results that come from proper squatting. This machine shifts your body weight into your glutes to tone, tighten, and lift them. Don't let its seated position fool you into thinking that you won't feel it. It's effective and fun to use. So this is what the machine looks like once set up. I do have it set atop their dream mat, which is basically an equipment or yoga mat. So what makes it different from a traditional squat sans equipment? Without coaching and guidance, correct form can easily break down. This leads to forward pressure on the knees, undue stress on the spine, and a reduced range of motion. The DB method machine shifts the weight into your hips, allowing direct access to your glutes. Let's get into some details on this product. This product retails on their site for $229. There's the basics package, which includes the machine. There's also the essentials and the deluxe, which includes all their accessories as well. They also have a corresponding app with a free and premium version. This product has a no tools assembly design, meaning that its parts click into place. When not in use, this product easily collapses within minutes for easy storage under a couch or bed. You also have 30 days from receiving the product if you decide to change your mind for a full refund. So now we're going to begin the unboxing process. So this package has a net weight of 13.4 kilograms and a gross weight of 15.5 kilograms. So this is what all the contents look like. And I also have two accessories to share with you today. We have the dream mat as well as a resistance band. So this is what the machine will look like once fully assembled. They do have a quick jumpstart assembly process outlined on this brochure. So this is what the user guide looks like. For the assembly instructions, they also include a separate insert. So the first step is to attach the four end caps to the base of the unit. Two of them have wheels. So now we're going to bring the product to the upright position with the handlebars facing upwards. We're going to install these two knobs over here. Next, we're going to insert the seat extension tube into the mainframe. We're going to secure it in place with these two snap buttons. And we're also going to screw in this lock pin beneath. So this is what the machine looks like when it's fully assembled. To engage the product, you want to make sure that the four screws are inside the four holes on the bottom. Now your product is fully assembled and ready for use. So this is what the DB Method app looks like. They do have a free 30-day trial if you'd like to try it out. If not, it is $9.99 per month. Here I'm going to try the plie and sumo squat workout. What's up DB Method fam? It's your girl Aaliyah and we're going to dive into a plie sumo squat workout. Toes, that's how you know you're doing it right, right? Good. The seven minute workout went by quickly. Aaliyah was interesting and informative. This was a beginner class targeting the glutes, which I found to be very doable. So now I'm going to try the sculpt and sweat class with instructor Allegra Paris. This workout is 15 minutes long and on their app they'll show you what equipment you will need. Obviously you need the machine and I also have the Dream Band Pro which I will use for this workout. Hey, it's Allegra with the DB Method and today we're going to be doing an advanced glute strength workout. Your back is flat, spine is slightly rounded, belly is tucked in. This workout was definitely fast paced and great if you're already accustomed to using the DB Method machine. Allegra Paris is a personal trainer and fitness model, which I find to be quite inspiring. 
to increase the intensity of your workouts, you can attach the Dream Band Pro, which retails on their site for $20. I do like that they have the stickers reminding you to just place your heel here, because initially when I got the machine, I wasn't sure where to put the foot, but it's very clear based on those stickers. I would highly recommend to wear a pair of shoes or sneakers with good traction on it. It's a lot easier than doing it with a sandal or even barefoot. Preparing this unit for storage is quite simple. For the first step, we're going to remove this pin. Removing the pin will detach the tension bar. Next, we're going to hold the handlebars in an upright position and unscrew the two knobs in the front. From there, this entire machine will scissor and collapse. It's important to note that you want the seat portion on the opposite end of the wheels. We also have the strap to wrap around it to prevent it from opening up during storage. So now this is what the unit looks like when it's fully collapsed. We do have the wheels on this portion. Reassembling the machine is quite simple. First, we're going to remove the strap. Next, we're going to grab these two knobs and hold onto the handlebars while we screw them in. And lastly, we're going to reinsert this pin. So this machine suits a variety of heights ranging from 5 foot all the way to 5'10". I'm 5 foot 4 and I have my seat at the level 2 setting. The level 2 setting is suitable for heights ranging from 5'2 to 5'4". So now I'm going to go over my overall opinion. The first point I want to make is that this machine is fun and easy to use. It's quite motivating. In my opinion, squats can tend to be boring otherwise. The second point I want to make is that the marketing for this machine is quite attractive in terms of the before and after results, and they also have boot camps or goals you can participate in. To the best of my knowledge, there's not another product on the market like this. If you Google search squat machine, there aren't any close competitors. I like that this machine can be stowed under a couch or a bed when not in use. Lastly, nowadays strong bodies are in trend and this machine is right in line with helping you get there. So anyways, that should do it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to like this video, subscribe if you're not already, and comment down below what are your thoughts on this machine. Do you think it's worth it for the price or would you prefer just to do traditional squats sans equipment?